I'm Katetsu Kuga. This is what happens when you go against the Kiyagoku Gumi. I'm a 24-year-old Yakuza. I was right in the middle of teaching two delinquents a lesson they'll never forget. When I was eight, Mom left us for some guy. Where are you going, Mom? Sorry, baby. I'm sorry. I didn't even have a dad, so... I'm hungry. I was all alone now. Even my grandparents refused to take me in. So I was sent to a foster home. Soon I started hanging out with the bad crowd. Kotetsu! Ayo Yanagi got hospitalized! It was those guys from the other school, wasn't it? Let's go kill them! I was relentless against guys who messed with my friends. Ah! Stop! You're gonna kill them! I was alone my whole life, so that's probably why I was so overprotective of my friends. In high school, I was out of control. I was the strongest kid in the city. Think fast, asshole! Ah! I was fast. Nobody could keep up with me. Then, when I was 20, I was asked to join a Yakuza family. Kuga, I know how good you are. Why don't you come join us? Yakuza? <laughs> I guess. I got nothing else to do, so... So I joined the Kyogoku Gumi, a big Yakuza family in the Kanto region. <laughs> I love being a Yakuza. So, Mr. Ichijo, this is where they're hiding? Yep. They were running a prostitution business in our territory. What should we do with them? Kill them? What else? Alright then, let's do this. There is no going back now. Knock knock! Surprise! Time to die! We got you now! What the? Crap! It's them! Mr. Ichijo taught me everything from scratch. Too slow! Think fast! <laughs> I learned from the best. Yeah, I've been with the family for a few years now, but recently, there was something that was troubling us. We got robbed again! Kotetsu! You know anything about this? You accusing me? <laughs> Give me a break. I know nothing. Many of our guys were getting robbed by some local gang members. Yo, Go Go Gumi ran all kinds of businesses. Drugs, prostitution, guns, <laughs> you name it. This one is really strong! Sounds good! Naturally, we had a lot of cash on our hands. But as you know, Yakuza's couldn't open bank accounts. Nobody followed you? No, I'm sure. So we stored our cash in our storage facility. But a few months ago... What the? What happened? No! Somebody started stealing from us. Just the other day, someone stole 80 grand and 7 handguns from our stash. We gotta do something about this! I gotta find out who's behind this and kill him. I'm gonna make these guys suffer. They always came in from the windows. Ah! They were in and out within 3 minutes or so. They were good at this. If you get caught stealing from the Yakuza, it wasn't gonna end well for you. You hiding anything in your stomach? Let's check! But if you got away with it, you could make a lot of money. It was a high risk, high return type of thing. But how? How do they know exactly when to strike? We got people guarding that place. Mm, we got a rat among us. Mr. Ichijo, I don't want to say this, but... I know what you're gonna say. Got a rat. Whatever happened to loyalty, huh? Could be anyone. Yeah. It wasn't like this back then. Everything started to fall apart after our old boss died. What now? Mm, his shoes are too big to fill. His family is gonna fall apart. Mr. Kazuka became our new boss. After that, everything started going downhill. We got some nice stuff from the Mafia in the Philippines. <laughs> nice. We're gonna make millions with this thing. Our old boss told us to stay away from drugs. But Mr. Kazuka decided to switch things up. We started stealing from normal civilians as well. Look at all the money we made for chicken old people. Damn nice! Nobody cared about anything anymore. The family was a mess. Mr. Sagara, get that dirty money out of my face. What did you say to me, Kuga? You know who you're talking to. You wanna go? His name was Sagara, aka Nightstick Sagara. He was one of the strongest guys in our family. Bring it! Your time here is over. You little shit! I'm gonna crush your skull! He was my superior, but I didn't care. He was hurting the innocent. Screw him. Our old boss told us to help the innocent. What's wrong, dear? Watch out! Ah! Tanaka! Ah! Standing up for what's right? That was our thing. But now, look at us. You're going down! You're dead, buddy! Son of put him in his place. 
Someone has to fix this. Ready or not, here I come! Wow! So fast! Think fast! Ah! Mr. Sagara, sorry, but your time is over. You little shit! Too slow. That was too fast for him. I could see his punches from a mile away. <laughs> the fight was pretty one-sided. Ah! So fast! Please, Mr. Sagara. Our family is falling apart. Stop doing this! Shut up! Don't tell me what to do! But he was tough. I got him pretty good, but he didn't go down. Then, a few days later, we got some leads on the gang who was stealing from us. One of them sold the gun they stole from us. He runs with a gang called Gigadeth. I see. I think we can find them a cure in town. Intel was everything in this business. So, we headed over to their headquarters. Then, this guy showed up. You say, Mr. Azuma? Mr. Azuma? He was one of us. He was in his late thirties. What's he doing here? We looked inside. He was talking with the other gang members. He's the rat. That's a shame. So, where's our money, huh? Kuga, what the? You piece of shit. Time to put these guys away. We started off by killing all the members of the Gigger Death. Go to hell! Ah! Die, you bitch! Fly! What the? You took them all out? How did you? You rat. You're gonna pay. I knocked him out. Then we brought him back to our storage. Kotetsu, one day you're gonna be leading this family. Oh, thanks. Take care of Azuma. I'm counting on you. I understand. Once we got to the storage, Azumi started begging me for mercy. Please! I'll do anything! Please forgive me! No. There's nothing you can do now. You betrayed us. And now, you're gonna pay. I threw him in an oil barrel and filled it with oil. Time to die. Ah! Nojima, light him up. Yes, sir. This is my subordinate, Nojima. He was really good at this. Hide, hide, hide! Here you go. Nojima placed a candle on the burning oil. Stay still now. Don't move now. Ah! If he moves around too much, the candle will tip over and he'll be dead in a matter of seconds. The oil bath was getting hotter by the minute. You like that? <laughs> Feels pretty good, doesn't it? Ah, it burns! It burns! Oh, being burned alive. That's gotta hurt. But to our surprise, ah! he didn't move. And the fire went out. Yes! I did it! Let me go! I'm impressed. I guess you really wanted to live. But I never said I was going to let you go. Ah! I threw the cigarette into the oil barrel. Ah! Ah! Wow. You went up in flames. Nojima, I'm going to fix this family. One day I'm going to be the boss. You with me? Of course, sir. First, I got to get rid of all the rats in the family. I'll follow you anywhere you go. Good. Just don't die on me, all right? I'm gonna fix this family and bring back the good old days. It's time to get to work. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to check out our other videos. And please subscribe to the channel.